People from all walks of life protested peacefully against the military coup in February 2021, and were brutally oppressed by soldiers and police. In response, large numbers of civilians took to regions under the control of ethnic armed organizations. They wanted to fight back against the oppression. Under the supervision of EAOs, they began to be militarily trained and started to fight back against the junta. One of the groups became known as Black Panther Squad Two, trained in the Karen National Union's Sixth Brigade area of Central Karen State. Despite the training, the groups lack weapons, food, and medicine, and their revolutionary forces at the front lines are in danger with the onset of the monsoon. With the onset of the rainy season, malaria, dengue, and seasonal flu is a major challenge in the revolutionary jungle camps. Inadequate medical care is a major concern for health officials. The main need is food. Comrade Ziawin, carrier from Black Panther Squad Two, talked about their struggles. Chenoluma, Lashiga, Jeka, Roma, Kerk, Yungan, and Nita. She's a Mukuzo Murin Yabi, Roma Jeka, Tulare, Jeka, Tulam Muda, and Roma Kerk, Yungan Yare, a char, put on Saturday, the car. Zia Win said, "Donors choose to donate only to well-known military groups, even though there were many People's Defense Forces camps in the Southern Regional Military Headquarters in Karen State." As donors only donate to well-known military columns. There is an excess of food and medicine in their camps, but in lesser-known camps, they are struggling to have daily meals. รับไล่มาเปลี่ยนอ่ะมาดิแกรับไล่มาเปลี่ยนอ่ะอีชื่อเด้อะรู้ว่ารับรับไล่เปลี่ยนออกมาอัญญ์แค่เนี่ยขา
The Black Panther Squad Toot of the People's Defense Forces is one of the official columns of the National Unity Government, NUG. These young members of the PDF want to tell NUG officials to send regular supplies of food. Oh, ไอ้ขาเรามาจนกูบ่กูยงกันพี่เราจนสาตอกเนี่ยเนี่ยอนิทาผิดเลยบ่แต่แกอายุจีก็จนกูตะเกชะเปยเนี่ยจนสิมะ